So we're on the fourth slide. The first slide was this one. If you haven't watched it, you'll find it in a previous video. Then we spoke about setting the scene. And then we spent 10 minutes discussing my vision for my city. An environmentally friendly, low cost, high quality of life place of abundance and friendship. And now we get to planning today for a happy tomorrow. <clears throat> now, people tell me I'm lucky. But, you know, there's that expression, the harder I work, the luckier I get. Gra Gary Player said that. And then there's the expression, luck is a matter of being in the right place at the right time. And then there's my corollary to that, which is in being in the right place at the right time is a lot of very hard work. <clears throat> we need to plan today for happy tomorrow we have to, in the previous slide you saw that if we look at all of our costs together not one at a time we can have a happier tomorrow we can predict the future so my neighbor might say to me you know david it's 2008 and you're spending five rand a kilowatt hour and i'm spending 50 cents a kilowatt hour and your electricity bill is so much higher than mine and I can say to him, you're right, it's true. And then I can say to him, you're driving a new car um, and it's costing you 200 rand an hour just for repayments for your car. And I'm driving a 10-year-old car, which I've paid off and it's not costing me anything per hour to drive. And he can tell me, David, that's true. And who is spending more? I'm At the time, I was spending about 40, 50 rand a month on electricity plus the repayments on my energy system. And I was spending less than him on my electricity bill as compared with his car repayments. And my overall standard of living looked worse than his because he was driving a nice car, going on expensive holidays and traveling the world and taking his family away on beautiful places to beautiful places like Mishlanga Rocks in Natal, and um, his life looked so much better than mine. But my planning was about having a cost of living that's going down all the time, as you saw in the previous slide, a quality of life that's going up all the time, a health situation that's improving all the time, my environment, which is getting cleaner all the time, my health, which is improving from a food point of view, from a drinking point of view, from a breathing point of view, and from a consciousness point of view. And so I put a lot of time into my life, into planning and looking for the future, the next 50 years, not 100 years, but also starting with what's important in the next three minutes. And we're going to see that coming up soon. So I wish you many blessings, and I wish that you look at your overall cost of living and your overall quality of life, and you don't look at one variable at a time. If you only look at one variable at a time, then in a business you might say, well, you know, the sales department is important because they make money, and therefore we pay the salespeople lots of commission, but actually it's the engineers who come up with the fantastic ideas. And then you pay the salesman a huge commission for making the sale, but actually that commission should go to all the people involved in that sale, which happens to include the engineers who created the drawings that allowed the widget to be built. Think about the overall situation, whether it's in your business, your private life, and then plan today for a happy tomorrow. Good night. Many blessings.